hi what's up guys welcome to my channel english tweaks in english there are a lot of great words to describe person people vary in terms of their physical appearance and personalities and the words that are used to describe them are just as varied some words are better suited to describing the physical appearance of someone some are best used to describe the person's style and others are ideal for describing the person's character traits it is important to have these words in your written and spoken vocabulary because you may at some point in your life face a situation that requires you to describe someone calm serene someone who has a calm personality does not get agitated or upset easily example sona's calm cool personality makes her the ideal leader for the hiking team arrogant consumed with self importance someone who is arrogant thinks too highly of high myself and thinks very little about the opinions of others arrogant people are often disliked by others example he was so arrogant that he neglected to take heed to the warnings of the locals that a trek up the mountain was dangerous humble meek considerate of others acknowledging of one's limitations example the humble librarian won the respect of all the library users eccentric eccentric personalities are out of the box they are unusual and often strange in the eyes of others example donna he was so eccentric that even the few friends he had had trouble keeping up with him charismatic the ability to effortlessly winning the affections of others example even though calvin was new to the school his charismatic ways soon won over most of the students and this was the main reason he won the race for class president flamboyant having a preference for the fashionably glamorous and expensive things a flamboyant style is also known as a larger than life approach people with this personality are extremely excessive in their search for attention the limelight and fashion example the flamboyant new office attendant got the attention of everyone each time she stepped into the office decked out in a trendy new outfit chic fashionably current a chic style is usually simple unique and fashionable all at the same time example Carmen has always been a chic fashion enthusiast so her decision to choose a career in this field did not surprise anyone eclectic possessing a style that is inspired by varying ideas and cultures example the eclectic world history teacher never ceased to amaze his students with new and culturally diverse wardrobe items modest simple and conventional the opposite of flamboyant or risk someone with a modest style usually go for the simple example the two girls couldn't be more different in style with samantha having a flair for the extravagant and samara being blonde a yellowish hair color this hair color comes in a variety of yellow or gold shades which range from rich or heavy to light this word is often used to describe a woman who has hair of this color men's hair can also be described as blonde example she bowed her head and started to pray all they could see was a mop of light blonde hair neatly arranged on her head and effectively masking her face brunette dark brown hair this word is used to describe a woman who has this type of hair example the amicable tall brunette contestant stood out among all her blonde counterparts lanky very tall and slim in an unappealing or clumsy way this word is often used to describe someone in a negative way example i carefully glanced at the reflection in the store window and realized that my stalker was a lanky greasy-haired man who seemed to be in his 40s 
generous, kind and considerate of others. Example, the fire victims were offered food and clothing by a generous community member who heard about their plight. Mysterious, difficult to understand. Seemingly secretive example, the most intriguing part of the novel was the mysterious stranger who appeared suddenly in the town. Creative, talented when it comes to finding new solutions, fixing things, or coming up with novel ideas. Example, the ideal candidate for the position is a creative, multitasker who has excellent people skills. Flexible, open to and accepting of changes. Easily adaptable to new situations and environments. Example, the new principal was flexible enough to allow for some very novel changes in the way the school is run, such as the introduction of student days where the students and teachers switch roles temporarily. So these are some adjectives that English speakers use these on daily basis. So start using them. So friends, this brings me to an end of this lesson. I hope you enjoyed watching. I will be back soon with new lesson. Till then take care and bye.